Welcome to qualification match 65. A couple of cargo scored by both teams. An attempt by the human player. With two minutes remaining in the match, there are already a lot of cargo balls spewed throughout the field. 1018 doing what they do best, delivering into that lower hub. 5010 with an impressive two into the upper hub. Unique to this year's game, the robots can climb at any time, so we'll have to see if any of the robots this match take that advantage. 1529 cyber cards launching in one to the upper hub and one just over it. 5188 classified robotics matching what cyber cards were just able to do. That's two, three cargo into the upper hub. Pulling blue into a slight lead. 5402 Dylan T. Lofting from the left side of the field. Does look like they do have one ball stuck in their mechanism. 7617 Robo Blazers launching one to the upper hub. A very precise one at a time launching from that team. 5188 matching them with two in the upper hub. 1529 Cyber Cards playing around with 5188 on the back side of the field. Definitely getting pushed around and shoved into the back of the tarmac. Two Blue Lions lined up here for some upper hub shots. Without even noticing, 5402 has started to climb and they're already on that traversal bar with 20 seconds still remaining in the match. Two Blue Alliance robots are hoping to match that score by maybe going to the mid rung and higher to that high rung if possible. 1018 Pike Robo Devils already on that mid rung. The higher they go, the more points they can stow. That's it for today's match. Score is 49 to 30 before final calls with five of the six robots suspended. Here are your finalized scores for Paul Fish match 65. It's the Blue Alliance. Edging out their competitors with a score of 61 over 57. Only with three ranking points, not a quite enough climb to get that third ranking point.